Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. In this video, I will show you the Zendrop WooCommerce dropshipping tutorial. If you want to know how it's done, then this video is for you. So you can see right here that I'm an actual lead on the WooCommerce dashboard. But for this one, well, let's head over to this My Stores. Now, once you have clicked on this, you should be able to see all of the stores that you have. So for this one, I'll head over and connect a new store. So click on this connect new store. And then you can put in here the URL of the Suwu store that you like to connect for this one. So for example, you can type anything that you want. But if you already have a store right here, what you can do is you can head over and just click on this manage store from in there. Now once you have done that, this will open in here a new tab that will show you the actual website or the actual dashboard of that specific store. So this is my store right here named TikTok Star 1 but for this one we will be using Zendrop for this particular tutorial. Now that we're here in our store, let's head back first to a new tab and then search in here for zendrop.com. Now on this new tab right here, you can see the actual Zendrop, which is actually a dropshipping application. So what you can do is you can head over and click on this get started now. And then once you have done that, this will prompt you to register or sign up to Zendrop. So for this one, I will just skip ahead and I will create an account for myself. So this is the dashboard of Zendrop looks like. So you can have in here the option to connect your Shopify and all of store that you have. But for this particular video, we will going to connect our Zendrop to our WooCommerce right here. So what we can do is you can head over and click on this. I already have a store and then click on continue. And for this one, it's actually chosen this Shopify. So what you can do is you can choose another platform instead. Click on this one. And then in here, as you can see, we don't have the option for WooCommerce. Now in here from your Zen job, next thing you need to do is to head back again to your WooCommerce. So on your WooCommerce, you can scroll down and from in here, you should be able to see this option for plugins. So click on that. And then from in here, scroll on again until you can see this option for just browse plugins. So click on this. And then from in here, it will open the WordPress plugins. Actually, my WooCommerce is connected to WordPress because they are basically the same. So you can click on the search plugins and search in here for Zendrop. Once you have done that, you can see this Zendrop Global Drop Shipping. So click on this one. And then in here, this will prompt you to download this. So click on this download option that you have right here. And then this will download this particular plugin in here. So in order to install it, you can see this installation example. We already logged in or we only downloaded it in. We just need to unarchive this and upload the extracted file directory to the WP content. Now you just need to head over and then proceed to this installation example. Now let's head back right here again. And then from in here, you should be able to see again the option for plugins. So if you already log in or upgraded to their plan, you should be able to install it seamlessly. Now once you have done that, you can head over again to your Zendrop. And then just try to see what the actual thing is. So here's our Zendrop in here again. So what you can do is you can click on this find products right here in order to find the product that you want to actually sell or drop ship to our actual WooCommerce. So let's head in here and search for the product. For example, let's search in here for a necklace. And then once you have searched for that particular product, you should be able to see the necklaces or the product that you want to actually get. So for example, let's choose this Christian necklace. So you can click on this add to my products and then once you have done that it will be added to your products right here so let's try to click on it and then as you can see here it is right here so before we push this to our actual woocommerce let's find more products that we want to actually sell so let's search in here for hat and let's try to get a few more things that we can actually sell let's choose this as well as this and also this one now let's head over in here to our products and we have this four right here. So you can click on this review and publish right here. And then you can see in here the product in here and you can actually publish it to your store. Now you can also see in here the description that will be added to your store. 
as well as the variants that you can actually choose from on your customer's point of view and you can also see in here the image that will also be added once you have pushed it to your actual store so what you can do is you can head over right here click on this publish to my store and then once you have done that this should be able to start drop shipping with zendrop on your woocommerce once you have successfully added this out now let's head back right here and you can also head over and then review and publish each ones that you have from in here now let's head over to the store listings and sourcing so you can actually get some source or add products to your woocommerce store and view them in one easy to find place so in here you can actually get some store listings and sourcings which will actually look like this and in here you can see in here the issues that you have for now so this will actually show all of the issues that you have on your products now in here you can also click on this orders and then from in here you can see all the orders that has been fulfilled by zendrop that is actually checked out from your woocommerce store if you already connected it on your case now let's head back in here on the extras so in the extras right here you can access the branding but this actually requires a plan in order to access this feature now you can also see in here also the bundles and boxes and also the more specific type is the aliexpress import we all know that there's a lot of products in aliexpress that you can actually ship the zendrop and then ship some zendrop to your actual woocommerce so let's head in here to a new tab and let's search in here for aliexpress so on this aliexpress link that i have you can actually see in here this particular thing right here so you can actually connect this aliexpress using the link that we have on a url and then drop it on your zen drop and then on that specific product you can actually link it in order to be actually pushed on your products right here and the same thing can also happen and just head over and click on this review and publish button right here in order to push it to your woocommerce store from in here so once you're on your woocommerce store you can head over to your products and on the products that you have from in here you should be able to see all of the products that you have pushed from your zendrop or aliexpress to your actual store on woocommerce so you can actually import export and add new things from in here you can also see in here the brands categories and attributes and you can also see in here the summary of the orders that will be taken from your actual woocommerce store so all the taken order from your customers whether it's already fulfilled or failed will actually be able to be head over and then added in here this particular section of your woocommerce same thing will also happen in here under your customers wherein they will be able to be displayed from in here and you should be able to head over and use their email for your email marketing now on this payments you can see in here all of the payments that you can actually get or you can actually support on your Woo payments so you can use visa mastercard amex and all of these things that you can see right in here so that's the whole process. If you have found this video helpful, simply leave a like below or subscribe because it helps reach more people. See you soon.